Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Mame Monday. So if you guys are new to my channel and you don't know what Mame Mondays are, I'll leave links down below so you can check it out. But basically a snippet of what Mame Monday is, is I come to you guys every Monday and I give you guys inspirational things, motivation, or talk about absolutely anything. So kind of Mame Monday is kind of like a free topic Monday. So today I will be talking about... Um, waiting on god and you know staying motivated and stuff like that so i just want to show you guys a quick story um of what i've been through and just to kind of encourage you guys and give you guys advice at the end so if you're interested in watching this video stay tuned guys so basically um to start off with my story um i am a designer a young upcoming designer and um i make clothes and stuff like that and recently, um, last, this year, in the beginning of this year, I was supposed to make, like, you know, a lot of stuff, but I just felt so discouraged. I wasn't motivated. I didn't even come out with, like, a proper summer collection. And I always do this, but I didn't feel, like, motivated. And my biggest thing was I, depending on, I depended on people a lot to just kind of help me, motivate me. But as time grew on, like, I learned to be my biggest motivator. So I had this fashion show at this certain university and it went good, but there was this other university I wanted to be a designer at. And I was really, um, I was praying that I get that, like, I guess you call it like a gig, right? So I was praying I get that gig, um, but like, you know, things happened. I didn't get it that year that I wanted it. So I just, you know, I just prayed about it and, you know, I kind of left at it, but I lost hope. And um, that was like the horrible thing I've ever done is just to, to lose hope. I didn't feel like sewing anymore. I feel like people I reached out to to help me wasn't helping me out. I feel like everything was bad. Like I would reach out to people, hey, came out of my stuff. And they weren't really like, you know, giving me like a, how do you say, like a feedback. And they wouldn't really help me out through that situation. So I'm just like, oh my God. Like I, I had like an aha moment. And I realized that you can't really depend on people and you can't really like, you know, put your trust and faith in people that they're going to help you out in your time of need. They're going to like, you know, make things happen. So I just, you know, I like thought about it really well. And I was like, you know, I have to be my own motivator because if I'm not my own motivator, who else is going to motivate me? Who else is going to help me out through in my time of need? And that's when I started like, you know, praying again and I was like, I have to do this. I have to pick myself up. I have to do something. And what are the odds? I'm going to fail at it. I'm going to fail at doing this and stuff like that. So eventually, I, um, this currently this winter, I came out with my winter collection. And that was a battle too. Like, you know, putting it out there, people not buying it. In the beginning, it was just like, oh my God. Like, I almost lost hope. But I was just like, you know, Philippians 4.13 was like, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. So I got the strength from that. I just, you know, kept on motivating me. And um, I have this little quote on my dresser. It says, when we, put all, um, when we put God first, all things will fall into place. So I came to the realization of putting God first. And once I did that, I'm telling you guys, like, everything just changed. Like, if I became, like, this new person, I became self-motivated. I didn't care about what other people were doing, if they're going to motivate me or not. I'm like, I'm, it's my cross to carry. If you're going to help me out, join. If not, you know, I can do this all by myself with the help of God and by me putting him first. So I just want to encourage you guys that if you're going through anything, you feel like, you know, you feel abandoned, people are not there for you, just, you know, just pray. And I'm encouraging you, do not lose hope because God's time is the best. That's one thing I feel like sometimes we want to, um, we feel to understand, we want to rush things, you know, do things our way that we forget that we have a God who we serve, who is like amazing and his, in his time, he makes everything beautiful. He might not do it right for you as soon as you ask, but he has something better in store for you. So I'm really thankful for, um, everything I've been through, my experiences, my downfalls, and things like that, because it has motivated me to be a better person, and motivated me to be like, you know, I can do this by myself with the help of God, you know, because without God, I can't do all of this, so right now, I'm just like, I have like, I don't have a lot of friends that I used to, and I'm really thankful for that, because, you know, sometimes we don't need all these people to you know carry us like they're kind of like dead weight they're just there to be there they're not motivating you they're not inspiring you they're just there and I, right i just like wanted to cut them all off and have faith in god because without him none of this would be possible so um i recently got an email from 
the gig that I wanted so bad because I've been praying about it and I got an email and I was so so excited and they invited me to be a designer i'm just like oh my god and it's like a really big deal for me because i'm the youngest and everyone they've had on the fashion show like they were so talented and compared to me i'm just like oh my like i couldn't like i felt like i wasn't good enough to be invited because i felt like all the designers were really like you know high there you know they were just like doing couture and all that stuff i'm just like a young girl just sewing you know because i love to sew um and i was really thankful and that kind of like inspired me to after getting that email that kind of inspired me to do this video to let you guys know that don't give up don't lose hope god like in god's time he makes everything possible and have faith even if like your faith is just like a mustard seed like just have faith because faith can move mountains and you know just have faith, wait on God, keep praying, never, ever, ever give up because he's going to give you something better than you wish for and he's going to help you throughout. And I'm still going on my journey, you know, nothing is perfect and stuff like that, but um, I feel like I'm taking it day by day, you know, inspiring myself because self-motivation is the hardest thing ever. If you guys don't know, like motivating yourself to do something is really, really, really difficult because you got to like pick up yourself and do it. Whereas like, you know, if others are motivating you, it's a bit easier because you're just hearing all these good things like, you know, you can do it, blah, blah, blah. They keep encouraging you and stuff like that. It's all sweet, but you doing it yourself is really difficult. There are some days I know you're going to cry. There's some days you want to give up. But just remember that in God's time, he makes everything, absolutely everything beautiful and never, ever, ever give up. And I'm sorry. And I just want to end my message here. I'm sorry I'm moving my hands a lot, but when I like to, when I'm talking, I like to move my hands. It kind of like, I feel like I'm communicating with you guys by doing that. And I'm really thankful for every opportunity that I have. And if you guys want me to do any um, other videos, any topics, just feel free to leave your comments slash ideas down below. And I do these every Monday and I call them Mame Mondays because my name is Mame. It's not actually pronounced Mame, but people can't pronounce it, so they just call me Mame, and I kind of just went with the flow. So if you guys have any questions um, or anything, feel free to, you know, as I said, drop your comments, ideas down below. And if I can help you guys in any way, just shoot me an email, and I'll be glad to pray with you, glad to, you know, I like, kind of inspire you to give you the little boost that you need, because um, I wish I had that when I needed it. So I just want to say thank you guys for watching, and don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you.